Hello, we are here for one more lesson of this TFLEX CAD training course. The topic for today will be the addition of fragments. Um, as in other uh, commands or group of commands we've seen until now, um, the addition of uh, the objects uh, that we have uh, in TFLEX CAD uh, is done very easily uh, uh, just with uh, a click of the element. So the idea now is to create one fragment. We will create then one assembly drawing called the fragment inside and uh, uh, I will show you how to make the addition. So uh, create a very simple um, drawing. Um, I can create a, a circle for example. I will give it a, a, a variable radius um, say something, do it as an external variable, graphical line, you know all these steps already. And um, now I will save it, just saying uh, ISO, let us give it a name, frag, save it, okay, no, nothing unknown until now. Uh, now I will create uh, a one drawing, which will be uh, our assembly drawing. This is a little slow. Okay. Um, I will create something to connect my fragment. Um, I forgot to create in this particular case uh, a fixing vector, but let us do that. Okay. For example, like this, you know it already, save it on top. Again, uh, assembly drawing and let us call the fragment. So just choose the file, frag, you know it already. So place it where you want. Okay, I will use this place here. You can turn it in terms of the circle. You don't know where it is, but uh, it's not very important. So the idea now, it is, um, we can simply click the fragment and we can at any given point in time uh, make the addition of all of these uh, elements. Um, we can uh, choose if we have several fragments, we can go into, into this function to uh, change several things, for example, uh, if we come to this option here, we can change uh, the, the fixing vector, the, the orientation and the insertion point, so we can give other options. Um, we can choose uh, this option here if we have several fragments uh, in, in our drawing and uh, if it is uh, difficult to choose the fragment you want, so you can pick it uh, from this dialog box, okay? Um, and you can also simply change the fixing vector, okay? Or the fixing point in, in this particular case. Um, so just say it and give, give it a, a new one. So this is quite easy to do, uh, nothing very uh, difficult. So uh, it's, it's not complex. Um, one other important thing is the, these options here that um, allow you to choose uh, if this is uh, embedded uh, uh, in, the, in the structure of, of the build of materials and so on. So you, you can choose some of these options. Um, and uh, the other important thing also in this uh, edition uh, it is, uh, we can uh, open this uh, fragment and uh, besides the addition uh, inside uh, the assembly environment, uh, we can open the drawing, for example, uh, in, in the drawing uh, of the part and in this particular environment, now you can change what you want, okay, in terms of uh, dimensions also, or the variables, or 
whatever you want. So I've changed it, so now it will uh, regenerate. Okay. Um, so uh, the idea it is we can make a lot of things. Uh, we can uh, edit uh, whatever you want when you want. So we can do this kind of edition also with your uh, right mouse click and simply choose, um, for example, uh, the edit or open it and make the edition here or uh, open the part in this particular drawing. So uh, we can do several things. The strong idea that you may uh, fix from, from this lesson, it is uh, the fragment is not something uh, uh, fixed. So uh, even when you do uh, the insertion on the assembly drawing, if you um, make uh, some change, let's try to do something. If we make some change in this uh, environment, in, in, in its own uh, drawing file, uh, we can do the update. Okay, let's save it. We can do the update and um, on the assembly file it will reflect the latest status of what you have. Um, that is why it is, ref uh, it is referenced to some with a particular path. So uh, this is not very hard. Um, all, all these uh, informations uh, we've been uh, talking about in terms of the fragments, in terms of uh, uh, the variables that may connect to the drawings will uh, now join in our uh, next lesson that we talk about uh, bills of materials. So um, I hope that these brief explanations about this edition of the fragments are, are clear enough to uh, give you this, tool, this additional tool. And as in uh, the other previous lessons, I mention it uh, always. If you have some issues or if you need some, some help uh, to clarify uh, some topics not so clear in this video, uh, just uh, contact us through the, the usual uh, channels that you know already.